Yeah, uh, good morning, my distinguished uh, gentlemen and ladies. Now I believe that is why I am coming up today, the first day of July 2024. Now I truly believe. Now I believe. Listen to me, grand community, and listen very carefully. There are times I will say God said, and there are times I will be saying on my own. You push your monitor carefully. Anyone that I said God said is God said. Because woe unto him that say God said and God did not say. That is why I'm coming to you today. I will tell you what God has made me to know. What God told me. And as I will also give my advice. Danger looms. Danger looms. Evil evil about to happen only if anyone that is involved will disobey this my word today my duty is to speak your duty is to listen do or leave as you can see i have been afraid since i saw this revelation i have been afraid but I told God that the only thing that will make me to come out fully, to believe it and come out fully is if this grant is not disbursed in this June. Because there is every, every, the atmosphere is very, very green that we believe that this money will have been disbursed in the month of June, this last June 2024. So when I saw that thing, I was afraid and I said, God, I cannot say it until I will be sure. And how will I be sure if this money did not drop that June? Now I am fully sure that it was God that told me, that revealed that thing to me. And that is why I'm speaking now. My friend at Mimosis always say it, and I will be saying it, but I don't even know. At Mimosis will say, there is a truth that will come out before this money will be disbursed. And me, I will be saying it too. But let me tell you, I don't even know what I was saying that time. And I believe that at Mimosis don't even know what he was saying. That there is a truth that will come out before this money will be disbursed. Now, listen and listen to me carefully. That truth is what I want to tell you people now. Now, let me tell you, I was in my revelation. Early this June. That was why I came and started clamoring. Say, if this money consigned to the dead, bribe me. Bribe me to, to be trees. That people should be careful. But I don't want to come out to say it fully then. Because I was afraid in my revelation. And I now decide that that are wait if god truly meant it like that let this one finish because i also need money i kept quiet i kept quiet since i made that little comment i now had a lot of voice note when i'll be hearing my mind will be telling me do you see confirmation do you see confirmation do you see confirmation but i decided to help myself so that i will not make mistake because we all told him that say god said and god did not say that is my fear. So I gave God time frame. And he has proven to me of the truth. That what I'm going to say now is what he said. Now listen to me carefully. Before I continue, I want to tell you, Mr. Abbas, and the, all the people that are involved, you people should not even worry that somebody castigated you, did this all well and all the rest. Don't worry. It was God that was saving you people, but you don't know. It was God that was saving you people. That is why if the money will lie on, another thing will come. If not, had it been that money was released in the hand of the way you people planned it, I am telling you truth. All the death that will come, all of you will surely die. Anybody that is involved must surely die based on the revelation I saw. And this death has no repair. The dead will also start to kill both your children and your wife. That your generation, you, you, that, that, that person's generation will not remain. 
So God, the Bible says, for God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son. That whosoever believe will not perish. That was why the love of God upon you, see, you people should go and do thanksgiving. And thank God for saving your life. Thank God for saving your life. Now let me just say, according to my revelation, early that June, I was uh, in my revelation. God called me, he said, come, I will show you something. I know how God spoke to me. I was, he said, I will show you something. Immediately he opened my eyes. We were moving to a mountain. And I saw Bosse D, the wife of Brimey, the one I know. I don't know if it's because I know her. I've seen her before. I don't know. Sorry, I was interrupted. So I don't know if it's because if it is because I have seen her or because that is the way God wants it. But let me tell you. I saw her far in the mountain, kneeling down before somebody. And we were going. As we were going, closer, I started seeing that person. He became Professor Brimey. And whenever I see the dead, I don't I don't talk about it. But what I know is God can use the statue, the, the, the appearance of the dead to speak to the living. You see? And we're approaching. We are approaching. Immediately I approach close. I what I had, I did not even understand fully well what that woman was kneeling down, holding that prof hand to hand. I didn't I didn't understand what she was saying because I was coming from afar. But she was crying. She was shedding tears. What I saw was what I now had when I drew closer was prof telling her, forget that it won't happen. If anybody tries it, all of them with their generation will perish. That I am the one that will do it. That that is my lifetime sufferness. It's my lifetime sufferness. So I've mandated you since I died. Even in that revelation, I don't want to say this. He narrated somehow how he died and what transpired to another. That is why the thing lingered like that. Now that he has asked her, that she is the one that will now take care take over everything about that grant that was when i now understood that she was crying concerning the grant and that man told her that nobody will tamper with the grant nobody will disperse it that it is him that since he's not alive he was alive and he will do things by himself now it belongs to him since he's not alive that he is still alive in her that don't, that she, she he told her there yeah, in that revelation don't worry that nobody will do it anybody that do, does it that person and the generation will be closed that is dead and remember i've not said anything say somebody will die before but i saw this one this was the way i saw it too i don't know who is involved now when he was saying that he now told him they will come take care of it properly I can see the cry of the masses. Take care of it properly. Though it's not the way I planned it. But do it the way that it will be more better. This was what he told that woman. Now listen to me. In that revelation, he was saying, Tom turned around and started telling me. He said, in any organization, what is organization? What is organization? Does organization do something without human being? Does organization do something without human being? That the human being is that organization. No NGO can do anything without the human being. He said, listen to me. This thing, I facilitated it. And because Beatrice was the only person I trusted, when she approached me, I decided to bring it down. He was saying that he don't even that he he, he has no intention self of bringing it down. But when he when the time he tried it, the country messed him up. According to that revelation, he now decided to stay out to do carry out his project. But when Beatrice approached him. He now decided because of Beatrice to bring it down, to start from the country. And he has agreement with Beatrice 
that he only gets Beatrice few as to disburse through her NGO. Few, just little. But the other one belongs to him, that he will be the one that will mastermind it. He will now disburse others and make the the, the project. That his money is mainly on project. That was what the man was telling me like this. It was made for project. That the, the project belongs to him. He knows how he wants to do it in the whole state so that they will belong. They will participate and his name will be written in gold. That was what the man was telling me. Now, people are now claiming what does not belong to them. That he, he gave Beatrice little, little there. So that one is one that consigns Beatrice. That one is the one that consigns Beatrice. But the whole money, the whole money belongs to him. Not the organization. And he told me that he is the president of his organization. He was not elected. That is the president. And all the people he made. Now listen, that is where I want to advise UAAG people. UAS people, not UAG. That UAAG does not exist. Unless they have gone to register it later. He said to me, and I want to tell all the members of UAS. Your joy has come, but be very careful. Any mistake anybody does now, the concise thing, because he will go for it. Prof did not elect any of you. And you people did not elect Prof. He called you people for partnership and he appointed you people. So Prof said I should let you people know that the president of his organization remains with him. That if you are vice, you, he appointed you. That he does not have what, what he was telling me. I don't know the one that is true, but I came to believe this. That he did not have board of directors. He did it by himself. The organization belongs to him. Although nobody knows he will die. So all of you who are members, appointed members, even in debt, he remains the president. That is what he was telling me. His wife, he has handed over spiritually to his wife, Bossy. Now, even if he has other wives, I don't know about that, my advice. Nobody should bring trouble between them. Bossy, they will be the one to lead. After getting everything that belongs to Prof, they can now go and share and do whatever they want to do first to establish Prof. Prof was doing those things to make sure at last he will be established. So you people, nobody should now go. Begin to look for the son of uh, Prof. And, um, excuse me. Sorry. Nobody should now go and begin to look for the son of Prof. Or wife of Prof. To put them in asunder. Because of your selfish interest, you want to follow here. The big person you will follow is this one that she has appointed. Anybody that faces it, my hand, no day. You will see it live. You will see it live. So, U.S. members, listen to me. You people should rally around this woman. And she is the one that will appoint anybody or any position she would like to work with that. That is Brimey for you. That is my advice. So, that is my advice. Based on what he told me, what I saw in my revelation. Remember, I said, God said, come, let me show you something. So, all of them, is heading that God told me. Though he uses the, 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 the physical appearance of that man to say what I am saying now. So listen to me please. You push be careful. Nobody should contest about being a president of UAS. It belongs to Brimey and no change. No change. Until maybe if they are no more and they can never be. Nothing will make that family not to be no more. And please, nobody should even try or think to harm that woman. It is in your own detriment, I bet you. I saw this thing very clearly. That is that for these members of UA, UAS. Move to a prof. He's the one that takes care of everything. And he has handed over to this woman.
no wonder i was I, I was disconnected from this one for months i don't even know not knowing that god wanted to let me know something because i didn't have been moving speaking with her uh-huh. they might say it's because I, I i have been speaking with her but she don't even know what i'm saying because for months now i've not communicated i don't know what happened i did not know what happened i was I, i've been calling her every time i, I feel like but for months i didn't know not knowing that God is preparing me to show me this that I'm saying now. That is one. Two. Listen to me carefully. This one now is for Josephat and the family of Odudu. Please. Please listen to me. You push, you go. Just whosoever that takes matter consigning you people to court, go and withdraw it. There is no need again. No need. The money you people are fighting is Brimey's money. Little peasant, little, little one he gave to Beatrice. Is it what you want to kill yourself? Is it what you want to kill yourself? Let me just tell you the truth. God Almighty knows I won't side anybody. I have never seen Joseph before in my life. And since Joseph had saw that I was supporting Ken, Joseph had has counted me as his enemy. I don't care, but I will say what I am led to say. My own advice. Listen to me carefully. You people are talking about the the uh, uh, say Marita's NGO or oh, 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 cooperative. Marita's cooperative. How do you know that money was brought? Before you talk about cooperative, NGO, any company, you talk about human being. If Rita is alive today, he can decide to change anything. If anybody that is portraying something can change anything. Remember, the money belongs to Brimey, but little one that belongs to. So nobody should make a mistake oh, that belong. He gave, he said, okay, this was this. Let me handle this. So that little one is what you people are fighting for. Not the whole money so that you will not put yourself in danger. Now that little one, let me tell you something. You people know that Joseph had married to your sister. That is the simple truth, you know. Thank God for that. Let me tell you. Anybody can have an organization when he has not married or she has not married. So if his name is not in the in as a board of trustee members in that uh, organization, it does not matter anything because you can't person first before organization. Let me tell you, the cooperative I went to restart newly recently. It has not taken time. Oh, some months ago, the people I put their name there, they don't even know my children and some people that are using completing it. Because I don't have uh, enough children to complete such number they ask I should bring. Those people don't even know. So it's assumed that even Beatrice do not even, uh, uh, these people that are there that Beatrice put did not even know that their name were there until when she has finished registering it. Maybe he has told them. That is just the simple truth. But the major thing you people should look at is the human being, the person that owns it. Now let me tell you something. He might be doing that in, his, in the name of his NGO. Let me tell you, he gave Prof an NGO, which I don't know if it's his own, no, or as rumor is going, Aposken's own. But mind you, the NGO he gives does not mean that the, the, the money belongs to the NGO. The money belongs to her, the one that concerns her. Remember, it was Prof's money. Oh. So that little one that belongs to her, belongs to her. The main money belongs to Prof, not the NGO. Because he that has something can decide to change it. So you should not be putting the matter of NGO there. But look at what I want to tell you. Everybody needs to belong. But you should be careful. If you are fighting concerning the, the, the cooperative that Joseph's name is not there, does that make sense? It does not make sense that he has gone to change it, this and that. It's in the court, oh, but I'm saying base. I'm saying on spiritual base. Because I've given the opportunity to talk spiritually. And you don't talk spiritually to, to people that are dead. Spiritual people, you talk to physical people. Because I was advised to bring it to physical. That's why I'm saying this. So please listen to me carefully. There is no need to quarrel. Since you know it's your brother's wife. Now let me tell you. 
if you go to court today and say hey he's not in the documents he's not a bot and it, how many people how many tell me truth you people that are saying this now are you in the in the bot how many people remain alive in that something so it does not matter what matter is that it is beatrice or dudu not the ngo or the cooperative beatrice or dudu and beatrice or dudu is not owned by one person but let me tell you, as long as this country is consigned by law, somebody owns Victrice Ududu. Others follow. If you go and the video, his name is not there, yeah, no problem. He now turned back and now sue you that he needed his wife's property. What will you say? We call say no, that uh, NGO does not belong to the wife. I'm not sure call will say that or they know better than me. But what I'm saying is he owns Victrice. Please, I am begging all of you. Calm down and let there be peace. Without this peace, it will be very, very difficult for you people for, for anything to happen in this country. And you people are for this disbursement to happen. And you people are causing it. Oh. You people are causing it. So please go and withdraw that. Joseph, I listen to the advice I want to give to you. You have to gather people now that you trust. Go and meet Beatrice Odudu family. Maybe you will not go because of fear. Just first let them go. Sit with them. I believe that Pastor John is listening to me. He will hear this, uh, uh, my voice note. He, as the ambassador of peace, should champion for this peace. Yeah, I have heard him say such thing before. Please continue. Continue now, please. And the senior brother of Beatrice is alive. Huh? You are just the spokesperson, as you said. But tell Harrison, as I heard, Tell Harrison, if I'm not mistaken, you know, all this now was hearing in social media. Tell him to, to open up his heart to accept Joseph Hart so that there will be peace. My Joseph, Hart, please go. Send people. They go first one, second one. When the atmosphere is clean, go. So that you people will appease the gods of their land. Do whatever they want you to do so that you people will be in peace and remove that court you people should come out of court it doesn't consign court this is a family affair since Beatrice has children for you as I had in social media since he has children for you for the sake of those children go and do Beatrice no more alive but you are alive the children is alive so I dare solicit go and meet them and I solicit to oh, 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 this family please forgive him no matter what happened nothing you will do today that will bring back the dead person it has happened it has happened it has happened it has happened forgive and and pardon him let everything be done because God mandated these people they must go and meet uh, 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 Mrs. Brimy. So if they miss Mrs. Brimy, Joseph Hart will be involved because of the one that belongs to the wife. And you people will get your own. Remember, this money is not for Joseph Hart and your family. This is for the masses. But through the, uh, Beatrice. So that you, people will not keep, the masses will not keep suffering in the hand of people. Please, I beg you. This is my advice. Again, Mrs. Bosset, listen to me. Nobody should request for one naira on this. Prof did not think it like that. The same thing, uh, 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 Joseph Hart, nobody should request for one naira when this thing come. Because God had decided to bring it to the owner. Nobody should take one naira. Listen to me carefully. The people involved. Thank God that God has used you people to see these documents which have been hidden for a very long time and was caused with with wicked by a wicked person you push you call that woman immediately and work with her she will now go back and work with the team she want to work with if you did not work with this woman and work with any other person it is not care no it is not anybody there oh, please i am begging you but ken will also get he will get god did not tell me that he will not get he told me he will get but he is not the one that will disburse the money if you have done anything to him to to disburse the money thank god that it does not happen because it is family debt i'm telling you but 
Mrs. Boss said, whenever they come, please. That is when I will now by the back tell you people the person that this money will not go to the way I had it, the way I saw it. That person will never partake in this money. You won't give him because of the evil he caused. Again, I want to even ask you people that are talking this thing that uh, got this link and this document. Are you not even? Can't you think in your brain? Can't you think? Don't you know evil? Evil is evil. You went to see something and you know exactly what that thing is carrying and you are trying to maneuver it. Don't you know it causes death? Something that pertains to the dead. Thank God for you people, for, for God though, for saving you people. If this one had been tampered with, none of you will have extension in this life again. So you put to remove your hands off, you know, concern you people. Just go to that woman, that woman and 